They were feeling me in the room. It's not came out. I couldn't breathe. My heart stopped. I saw I saw a bright light on my left eye, not from my right. My left eye, and I felt it felt like blood was coming out of me. They kept holding me down, and I couldn't breathe. And they told me if I stopped crying and acting up, I, I, they would let me go. But I kept fighting, cause I need. They told me that. Well, I don't think they told me, but I think they're thinking that they should take me away from you. Uh huh. And <laughs> I got bruises. I got scratches. I got. My, I even asked if they could call you and take me to Chris. You asked for Chris? <laughs> yes, and they said no. Okay. <laughs> I need my whole okay. life back. It's okay, it's okay, it's okay. I need my old. I was getting all crazy. What, what made you, what made you, what set you off? The thing that set me off was the guy who talked about killing myself got me mad. I can't remember how he got they take me to the quiet room, and then, and then they grab me, so I punched him in the face. But why did he grab you? Cause, I, cause I was mad at him. I wouldn't do my work. But why were you mad? I can't remember. That's why. Okay, but remember. what's the first thing that happened? <laughs> I can't remember. But, oh, oh, when I was in the room. Um, wait, why are you standing up for? Because I'm tired of them making fun of my family name. I'm tired of them calling me a psychopath. I'm tired of them making fun of my mom, of my dad's death, of my uncle's death. Why did they have to restrain you? Because I punched them in the face. And okay. And because I... And because I was going crazy, because... They made fun of my family. They were going to do a suicide thing and Clyde was talking about suicide crap when I had a, my dad die from suicide. I know. And they were restraining me. I was spitting out saliva, snot, everything that came out of my mouth. I was foaming out my mouth. I had foam coming out and I stopped breathing. Find all my family members who have died. What do you mean? Tell me that didn't change my life that I died. Tell me that no one cared. That none of them cared about me. Tell me that I was mean to my dad. I knew I was mean to my dad. We just didn't get along. It's okay. My heart stopped and through my left eye I just had surgery on. I saw a bright light through the gates of heaven. How do you know it's what that was? It was bright and I saw my dad up there, my nanny and my uncle. And that funeral saw me get in a ca casket at the age I am right now with my mom, my sister, and really crying with my little green penguin and my Christmas penguin in my grave and my Xbox and my video games. And then the teacher was laughing because I was dead in my casket. And then no one could see me ever again. I would be dead. And how, um, how did you die? I died from them strangling me with a with my blood not coming to my veins. My, I could after after that a few days later I died from it. And then one day. Okay, and what happened after that? After that, I had to calm down so they could start restraining me before I died. died. After I calmed down, then they said they would bring my mom to me and call her so she could come to the school, but they lied. She Did they really say that? Yes. And then after that, I was working and I had to eat cold lunch. In the quiet room or in your classroom? In my cubicle. Okay. They were strangling out me. I was screaming for my mom, screaming for Cody, screaming for Coda, Ben, Thomas, someone to come help me and get me out of there. I'm sorry, sweet pea.
It was in the middle because he kept aggravating me, trying to make me study spelling, so I, so I did it. And then I ended up staring at the window with my head down, thinking it was a psychopath, and I came home. Yeah. Hey, now is everything okay? Are you okay? What do you feel like? I feel stressed out. Like, I can't control my body anymore. Control my anger. Control my sadness. Control my happiness. Yeah. I feel like it's emotional. I can't control my body. I thought I'm just about to, like, jump off the house or something. And I don't want my sister and brother to go in here because I don't want them to end up like, a, like I am. Because I don't want them to end up. I don't want my sister and brother going here because I don't want them to see themselves dying in a casket with their mom crying. Everybody why they love it. No crying because they're dead. I don't want that to happen. I don't want them to go to Upperman Upper and say it's not true. But they're, the, I am not lying. They think I'm lying. But I'm not. I tell the truth. If they don't like me, I'm leaving them. Is and like grooming them and saying he's like evil because his hair is orange. And I'm like, and I'm like about to get berserk on them. And there's another kid. His name's Josh. He's like my best friend. Only friend in that class. And I must be as mean to him. So I don't like people being mean to my friends. I almost punched the Christian in the face over him because he's my bud. He is my bro. He is? Yes. That's good, sweet. He, he did tell me to go kill myself once, but. We're past that. We didn't know each other. Oh. Boy, who said that comment? Yeah, we're friends And now, now you guys are friends. Good job, sweet pea. Good job. We didn't know each other. Okay. Okay. I only have one friend in that whole class.